morning everyone rise and shine welcome back to my channel and to another vlog my name is Jordan if you are new here so happy you joined us today I'm gonna bring you guys along for a day in my life at sea so if you are new here and you are unaware I am a professional figure skater and I'm currently working and living on board a cruise ship so currently I am on the Voyager of the Seas this is my third contract with Royal Caribbean and I have been signed on here since February of 2022. Today's video is also a collaboration with my friend Daisy. So she has a YouTube channel as well. She's a really cool person. She loves to travel just like I do. She's also done the Semester at Sea program, which is something that I find so, so, so fascinating um, because it's a very different experience than my life at sea. So we thought it would be fun to show you what a day in our lives looks like while we're at sea. So definitely similar experiences as far as the lifestyle and traveling, but definitely very, very different. So I'll have the links to her video and channel below, but I need to head to the gym. That is the first thing on my agenda. I have already written out a to-do list of things I want to accomplish for the day, and gym is first on that list. So I actually kind of slept in today because we had late shows yesterday, and I didn't get to bed until like one o'clock. And then we had to change the time forward, so I really went to bed at 2 a.m. I don't know if you can hear, my voice is a little raspy. I'm not sick at all, I think I'm just a little sleep deprived. But I slept until 8.30. So, I'm gonna run up to the gym, I'm gonna take the stairs as usual, you already know the drill. 11 floors up, and we're gonna get going. I'm a huge tote bag girly, if you didn't already know. Got my tote bag here, Princess Polly. And I put all my gym essentials in it. Daisy's also a tote bag girly, so if you're not on that train, you need to get on it. But my first gym essential is this resistance band. I got it in a pack of three on Amazon. I'll have a link below. Love them. They're different resistances. That one's medium. I've got my Beats headphones. I want to say these are like seven years old. Definitely need to get new ones, but they still work like a charm. And then I have my Simply Modern water bottle. It's insulated, so it stays cold forever. I filled this up last night and it's still cold. And they have like 30 different color combos. So those are my gym essentials. Throw them in my bag and let's get up there. gym now. 
I had a really good workout. It was quite intense. I did a Chloe Ting video, a Lily Sabri video, and then I did my like 20 minute weight circuit. My hair needs to be washed tonight, but I don't have enough time because I have all skates this morning. So I just threw some dry shampoo in it and a headband and I'm calling it a day. I just prepared my breakfast. I have been on an oatmeal kick for the last month or so. You guys know I love my eggs in the morning. Breakfast ends at 8.30 now in the mess, which is really early. Like, I'm a morning person, but that means I have to wake up at, like, 7.30 to comfortably wake up, do my morning routine, and get to the mess in time. So instead, I have been making breakfast in the cabin, and it's been amazing. So I just have oats, I have honey, and uh, cinnamon, and I have bananas from Show Food. So I just made myself a little oatmeal and... Oh, so good. Delicious. I have about 30 minutes until I have to be to Studio B for three hours of all skates. So I'm going to eat this, maybe prepare a coffee if I have time, and head to Studio B. It is time for our beloved all skates. I wonder if it'll be busy today because it's a C day. I don't even know how many guests we have on board. But basically, I didn't mention this. For anyone that's new here and is confused, all skates is just like public skating for the guests. So basically all we have to do is set it up and have them sign the waivers and give them skates and helmets. It's very simple. All right, got my tote, got my water bottle. We're ready to go. tickets for each session so we just hand them out um, depending on when they want to skate and each session is 30 minutes and then we have a little stamper in case they don't have their c-pass and we clip their c-pass to show they signed their waiver say hi sam sitting up downstairs and luba and i are up here <laughs> everyone misses luba <laughs> she's not having it today <laughs> I'm in the PM's office right now. We just set up the all skates and we have a few more minutes till we have to open the door. I didn't have enough time to make my coffee, but there's a coffee machine in the office. And Tino, our PM, said we're allowed to use it for all skates. So I brought my coffee cup with some almond milk in it and I'm gonna make myself a cup of joe. I'm very, very, very excited. I haven't used the machine yet, so this is my first time. This is just the PM's office. If you haven't seen my ship tour, PM is production manager. So there's various things in here. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Bad news guys, the K-Pods that are in Studio B, like in the office, are not the correct size for the Keurig. So it wouldn't work. <laughs> and I just want coffee. So maybe I'll run to the mess really fast and get some mess coffee. It's not good at all, but it's better than nothing, you know? It's time for the mess coffee taste test, guys. <laughs> so just so you get an idea of the quality of this coffee. Nice, tasty. <laughs> not my favorite. <laughs> but it's free, so like I can't complain because we love free. I did put my almond milk and I have this Barista Virtually Zero Salted Caramel Flavor Syrup Concentrate. So this helps it taste a little bit better, but it can only do so much, you know? <laughs> this is a mood. <laughs> Everyone's mood today. <laughs> it's a sea day, yeah. Attention skaters, you have 10 minutes remaining in your session. minutes. with all skates. I just need to take a moment to acknowledge how amazing this community is, how awesome you guys are. Uh, I got to meet quite a few of you today at all skates and actually talk to you for a bit and have like 
a conversation, not just like a, a high and by sort of thing. And I'm so happy I could literally cry. Like, you guys are honestly the best. You mean so much to me. And it's a very surreal moment that I have been able to positively impact so many of your lives and brought positivity and entertainment to your life. And just thank you so much for coming back and watching my videos every week and just being incredible people and being so friendly like there is nothing that I enjoy more than getting to meet you guys and talk to you and Chrissy also brought me shout out to Chrissy she brought me peanut butter and Frank's hot sauce because if you guys have been around you know I'm obsessed with Frank's hot sauce like I could drink that stuff and peanut butter obsessed so she hooked it up she brought me them in her suitcase I don't deserve you guys. You guys are too good to me. So I have creamy peanut butter and I have my beloved hot sauce in bubble wrap. I'm at a loss for words, but genuinely this channel and this community means so much to me. You have no idea. You've changed my life. I just cannot wait to see where it goes. I just, I love you all so much and I'm so happy. You just like, you made my whole day. So that being said, uh, it's 2.30 now. Had my crappy mess coffee, and I kind of want more coffee, but I definitely don't need it, so I think I'm gonna try and drink some more water, and I might make some tea, actually. That's what I'm gonna do. So, low-key, I kind of have a snack drawer, guys. And I just got this tea in Germany. It's like wildflower or wildberry, something like that. So I think that's what I'm gonna make today. It's delicious. Not me spilling literally everything I ever drink. I just changed out of my blues because I'm done with work for the day, so I'm just wearing this little sweater from Princess Polly and these jeans that I thrifted. They're originally from Stradvarius. So that's my little fit for this afternoon. I need to do laundry. I hate doing laundry on the ship. It's my least favorite chore. My laundry bag is completely full though, so it really needs to get done and today is a good day to do it. So I'm going to not even try to go to twin deck. I'm just going to go back deck to do my laundry. I put my stuff in the washing machine right behind this wall right there. If you go through that door, then there's another door. So yeah, that's where my stuff is being washed. In the meantime, I'm back deck. It's like 3 o'clock, 3.30, no one's here really. And I've just planted myself here, and I'm gonna start editing. hours since I last vlogged. All I've been doing is putting my laundry away. I took a shower, washed my hair. That really needed to get done. Uh, listened to a podcast, went to linen, and redid my makeup because I'm actually going to go to the dining room tonight for dinner. I'm so excited. It's been quite a while since I've been because we do have the privilege of going to the dining room as entertainers, which is amazing. And there was a period where we had certain privileges taken away just because of COVID, but now they're back. So I'm really excited. I'm gonna go to dinner. I'm gonna enjoy myself, gonna dress up because tonight is formal night. 
and I figured that I would start on my makeup. Our reservation's at 8.50 p.m., and it is 6.50 on the dot right now, and I have to head to the conference room on board because the cast is going to watch the show together from last night, and we're gonna go over notes and just... Yeah, that's pretty much the plan. So that's at 7. That should take around 45 minutes to an hour. And then when I come back, hopefully, fingers crossed, my hair is dry. And I will do something to it in time for dinner. Here's a current fit check. Pretty much what I wear 99% of the time when I'm on board in crew areas. Because I'm always cold. ready for dinner. I just have my little red dress on from Cupshe. I absolutely love it. It's like a midi length, almost full length on me, and there's a nice slit on the left side. This is my first time wearing it out. I'm so excited, and I decided to do a red lip to match it, and I blow dried and straightened my hair, so I am ready to go, and I'm actually early for once, which literally never happens. I'm 15 minutes early. back from the dining room. It was such a good dinner. I had these stuffed portobello mushrooms. It was delicious. Um, and I had such a nice time with Pasha and Alex. Gab was supposed to come, but he ended up passing because he wanted to stay in the cabin and do homework. But in any case, I had a really nice time with the two of them. And now I'm back in the room. I'm in my pajamas. I'm gonna prepare for the rest of the night and just get cozy and go to bed. Like, I'm already in my pajamas. I'm gonna take my makeup off now and yeah, just chill for the rest of the night. I hope you guys enjoyed coming along for a day in my life at sea. It was really fun to bring you along. Also, I feel like I'm more productive when I'm vlogging because I'm showing you my day. So thanks for keeping me motivated. Um, if you guys enjoy Life at Sea content and you're not already subscribed, definitely subscribe because there is much, much more where that came from, and I love sharing my day-to-day -day life with you guys. But yeah, thank you for your love and support. Thank you again for just being an amazing community, and if you guys are ever cruising on Voyager while I'm here, please DM me or email me. Let me know because I would love to meet you guys. It's probably my favorite part of having like this community is to be able to meet you guys in person so yeah definitely let me know if you guys are cruising but otherwise i'm going to hop into bed thank you again for watching and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys